Thank God for the rain, which has helped wash away the garbage and the trash off the sidewalks. Six in the afternoon to six in the morning, sometimes even eight in the morning, six days a week, sometimes seven days, but it keeps me real busy. Three, three fifty a week, sometimes even more when I do it off the meter. All the animals come out at night. Pussies, buggers, queens, fairies, dopers, junkies, sick, venal. A real rain will come and wash all the scum off the streets. I take people to the Bronx, Brooklyn. I take them to Harlem. Some won't even take spooks. Don't make no difference to me. Driver 48th and 6th, please. Be a big tip in it for you. You do the right things. You got away. Hurry up, will you? Stepping. garage I have to clean the cum off the back seat <laughs> clean off the blood that plan my name is travis that's nice what can i do for you know what your name is what's your name you can tell me what your name is i'm not gonna do anything you don't have to call the manager i mean i'm just asking. troy all right okay i'm just jujubes are uh, they last long i'd like to get some jujubes. what you see is what we got what well, the is all together Dollar eighty-five. It's my single hours of work and I still can't sleep. Life needed was a sense of some place to go. I don't believe that one should devote his life to morbid self-attention. Saw her at Palantine campaign headquarters at 63rd and Broad. Appeared like an angel. Out of this filthy mess. She is alone. We are the people. And R is underlined. These new buttons have we underlined. Well, I think there's a difference. We are the people is not the same as we are the people. Look, same sentence. We'll make it real simple. Get the new photos. I didn't forget it. Now look, we have to emphasize the mandatory welfare program. Senator Palantine is a dynamic man, an intelligent, interesting, and I did not forget sexy. Listen to what you're saying. You sound like you're selling mouthwash. You are so. Of course, living with his wife, anything would be jail. Look over there. I love you. Taxi driver's been staring at us. She knows. And it's sitting there. How long has he been there? I don't know, but it feels like a long time. How do you? No. And tell him to move. And I don't need good luck. Thank you. Oh, yes, you do. Hey, you're blocking our doorway. You think you might want to move the cab? My wife uses it. Yeah, it's Travis. He's a ladies' man. Yeah. He changes her pantyhose. No. Oh, yeah. But what'd you do? And I jump in the back seat and I whip it out. I said, you know what this is? <laughs> Fuck her brains out. She does a wild, you know? She said, it's the greatest single experience of my life. Remember in Acapulco? You know, some fleet driver from Bell just got all cut up. Stick up? No, he got cut up by some crazy... 122nd Street. You handle some pretty rough customers, huh? Yeah. Very peaceful. No. Need one. I know a fella can get you a real nice deal. What's it? Peace. Something to have just as a threat. You take it, and if you can sell it, you give me half of what you got. I don't want really to. Wow. Well, yeah. Oh, oh, oh. What? Terribly. What the hell? Nothing. Oh, that's very cute. Fingers missing on this hand. Yeah. And that hand missing on that hand. Yeah. Light the match. I wouldn't light a match. Go ahead. Give it a try. Just a minute. 
Yeah, no, he's walking. I can't do it. Well, the guy at the newsstand can do it. I've been a thief. I mean, they do that. The mob does that a lot of times. If, 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 they, uh, if a thief screws up on the job, you know, they'll blow his fingers off. Well, a stool pigeon, they leave a canary on the body. Walk right into a pet store. As long as you pay for it, boom. Kill it right there. Put it on anyone you want. Doesn't matter. He's probably me too. Like the volunteer. Great. I'll take you right over That's here. That's all right. I'd rather volunteer to her if you don't mind. I think that you are the most beautiful woman I've ever seen. Thanks. What do you think of Palantine? He'll make a good president. I don't know exactly what his policies are, but I'm sure he'll make a good one. Senator Stan on welfare, but I'm sure it's a good stand. Man. <laughs> you sure that? We'd just like to step over there. I'm sure that the gentleman well, will I, sign you up. Please, I, I drive a taxi at night, so it's good. Would you like to come have some coffee and pie with me? Why? Why? Instead. I think you're a lonely person. I see all these phones and all this stuff on your desk, and it means nothing. In your eyes, and I saw the way you carried yourself, that you're not a happy person. I think you need something. You're going to be my friend? Yeah. It's a little hard standing here and asking you something. Five minutes, that's all. Just outside. Right around here. I'm there to protect you. Come on, just take a little break. I have a break at 4 o'clock, and if you're here... 4 o'clock today. Betsy? Travis. Yeah. May 26th, slice of melted yellow cheese. I think that was a good selection. It's the organizational problems. Mm. Yeah, I know what you mean. I got the same problem things, like my apartment, my possessions. I should get one of those signs that says, one of these days I'm going to get organized. It's a joke. O-R-G-A-N-E-Z. I think Palantine's got a good chance. You know you have beautiful eyes? Do you like the guy you work with? He's OK. Uh, I would say he has quite a few problems. I can tell by the way you were both relating that there was no connection whatsoever. Something between us. There was an impulse that we were both following. Split. I never would have felt that I had the right to talk to you or say anything to you. I never would have had the courage to talk to you. Then I knew I was right. Did you feel that way? I wouldn't be here if I didn't. I, not that I don't like him. I, I just think he's silly. I don't believe I've ever met anyone quite like you. You with me? I have to go back to work now. Follow me now. I mean, like another time, though? No, no, just the part about the contradictions. You are that. She said maybe we go to a movie together after she gets off work tomorrow. That's my day off. I called her again and then she agreed. But I forgot to ask her last name again. Damn, I gotta remember stuff like that. Uh, are you Charles Palantine, the candidate? Yes, I am. Everybody that comes in this taxi today have to vote for you. Why, thank you. There's stickers in my taxi, but, you know, the company said it was against their policy, but they don't know anything, you know? Let me tell you something. I have learned more about America from riding in taxi cab. What is the one thing about this country that bugs you the most? You clean up this city here, because this city here is like an open sewer, you know? It's full of filth and scum. I go out and I smell it. I get headaches. It's so bad, you know? And they just, like, they just never go away. This whole mess here, you should just flush it right down the fucking toilet. It's kind of bad. Well, uh, we're gonna have to make some radical changes. Sam straight. Nice talking to you, Travis. Nice talking to you, sir. You're a good man. I know you're gonna win. Get me out of here, all right? Come on, baby. This is a real drag now. Come on. Come on. Don't make me upset. Wanna get busted? Come in a bitch. Be cool. Yeah, so I deep busted. Yeah, but just forget about this. It's nothing. Be cool, bitch. Got a present. Oh. Now back to Gene Krupa's syncopated style shortly. Yeah. Oh, what else am I going to do with my money? My, my record player doesn't work now. The stereo's broken? Yeah. How can you stand it? I couldn't live without music. I'm thinking maybe, you know. You can listen to it on your record player. Chick Webb. It's a dirty movie. No, no, this, this, is, the, this is a movie that uh, a lot of couples come to. Yeah, I see them all the time. Why? I 
don't know why I came in here. I don't like these movies. That way about this movie. I don't know much about movies, but if I... You feel the kind of movies you go to? No, no, I don't like this is about as exciting to me as saying, let's fuck. Falcon, but I can take you another place. Which is different. Wait a second, wait a second. I have to go. You gotta go now. Talk to you at least? I mean, will you at least talk to me? I didn't know you... Look, won't you take the record? I'll get to Let's go. Can I call you? Hello, Betsy. Hi, it's Travis. I didn't know that was the way you felt about it. That's the way you felt. I, have, I, I would have taken you somewhere else. This is not a 24-hour virus, you know. It's gonna happen. Yeah. Would you like to have uh, some dinner uh, with me um, in the next, you know, few days or something? I send uh, some flowers. Times to call her, but after the first call, she wouldn't come to the phone anymore. The flowers only made me sicker. The headaches got worse. I think I got stomach cancer. Only as healthy as you feel. You feel. Skipping and sounding alone. I don't have any trouble. Okay, you're talking about why won't you talk to me? Why won't you talk to me? Why don't you answer my calls when I call? Please. Get your hands off. Okay, then leave. Okay? I just want you to know that I know. Let's not have any trouble. Okay. Get okay. your hands off. Okay, then just leave. Hang on. All right. So die in the hell like the rest Come of them. Come on now. Know. There's a cop across the street. You're like the rest of them. Look, I'm calling. Officer! Don't come around here. Because I call the police. How much she is just like the others. Cold and distant. They're like a union. Mm. Then I cross it. Right. To the curb over there. Oh, don't, don't, don't. Oh. Oh. Fucking meter. What are you doing? Did I tell you to do that with the meter? Put the meter back. Where it's my time to discuss this. Put the meter back on. Put it, put it down. Don't write. Put the thing down. Just sit. Pull over to the curb. When we pull over to the curb, we're going to sit here. Go up there in the second floor. What, are you blind? Do, do you see the light? Do you, do you see the woman in the window? Just see that woman because that's my wife. It's not my father. You know who lives there? Huh? Lives there, I'm just saying. But you know who lives there? And this huh? one is sitting. A nigga lives there. Really like that. And I'm, go I'm gonna kill him. <laughs> Listen, I just, I'm gonna kill him. Think about it. Don't answer. You don't have to answer everything. With a 44 Magnum pistol. I have a 44 Magnum pistol. I'm gonna kill him with that gun. With a 44 Magnum pistol, we do to a woman's face. I mean, you're gonna fucking destroy it. Can do He's gonna do it. Head gun. That you should see. That you should see what a 44 magnum is going to do a woman's pussy, you should see. You must think I'm pretty sick or something. You know, you must think I'm pretty sick. Right? You must think I'm pretty sick? I bet you, I bet you really think I'm sick, right? You think I'm sick? <laughs> I'm paying for the ride. You don't have to answer. <laughs> I picked up this midget, you know. Oh, the guy was a midget. The blonde was the lady. Oh, the, the, I, got... I mean, the lady, yeah. I pick up these two fags, you know, they're going, they're going downtown. <laughs> Yelling, the other says, you bitch, you always start beating him on the head. Don't go busting heads, you know what I mean? God love you, do what you want. Tell him to go to California, because I'll split up. One's got to pay the other one alimony. A little way ahead out there, you know what I mean? California. It's loading, loading. I'd be broke tonight if I hadn't caught me some people from Ohio. I can't. Can I talk to you for a second? Bye, killer. Get out for you, That's why they call me the wizard. I got to shut you down? Yeah. yeah. That's the best of them. Yeah, I got me real down, real down. I just want to go out and, and, you know, like really, really, really do something. I really want to, I got some bad ideas in my head. I just, he becomes what he is. You, know, you do a thing and that's what you want. I mean, like I've been a, I've been a cabbie for 17 years. See what I, what I want. You know, to be on a night shift, grabbing somebody else's cab. You understand? Guy dies, another guy gets well, and, you know, people are born. I, I envy you, you drunk, you know, you do anything. I mean, we're all fucked. More or less, you know? He's lacking uh, enjoyment. I don't know, that's about the dumbest thing I ever heard. I mean, I don't even know what the fuck you're talking about. Uh, I don't know, maybe I don't... Relax, killer, you're gonna be all right. I know, I've seen a lot of people and, uh, yeah, you know, you're all right, you're all right. In the other party, I think that my programs are better defined than that's a way. Mm -hmm. I think it's like mm -hmm. a people rule. I felt that I was being somewhat overly optimistic. I must... Mm -hmm. Just not yet. Is that good?
stores everywhere. There's no escape. My life has taken another turn again, distinguishable from the next. A long, continuous chain. There is a change. What? This here's Easy Andy. He's a traveling salesman. How you doing, Travis? Expensive weapon. That's all right, I got money. I'm selling the gun. I put a car at 100 yards, put around right through the engine block. Medium high resale weapon. Look at that, that's a beauty. You could sell this gun to some jungle bunny in Harlem for 500 bucks. Might be a little too big for practical purposes. In which case, for you, I'd recommend the 8 snub nose. Look at that, that's a beautiful little gun. It's nickel plated, snub nose, stop anything that moves. Yeah, it's pretty cool. A magnum. I use that in Africa for killing elephants. You go out and have nails with it all day, come back and it'll cut dead center on target every time to it a heck of a wallop. It's a nice little gun. It's a beautiful little gun. Hold six shots in the clip, one shot in the chamber. Look at this. 380 Warfare. Hold eight shots in the clip. And that's a beautiful little gun. Look at that. They use this gun to replace the P38. Just giving out to officers. Isn't that a little honey? Oh, what's he going to play? How much for everything? Any jackass would carry that cannon in the streets like that. Handmade holster I had made in Mexico. Forty dollars. Thirty-eight. One and a quarter for the twenty-five. One fifty for the three-eight. You take this coke, mescaline, downers, nebutol, tonal, chloral hydrates. Isn't that stuff? Crystal meth. Like get your crystal meth. Nitrous oxide. How about that? How about a Cadillac? Yeah, I get a brand new Cadillac with the pink slip for two. <laughs> I gotta get in shape now. Too much sitting has ruined my body. Now on, it'll be 50 push-ups each morning. 50 pull-ups. There'll be no more pills or bears of my body. Organization. Every muscle must be tight. Wow. Yeah. Oh, yeah. No, I cannot play the, the theater. All the king's men cannot put it back together again. And what is that? Yeah, it's on low there. I mean, where's he going? Is he targeting her? Hey, and you're a secret service man, aren't you? Huh? Waiting for the senator. That's a very good answer. I asked uh, if you were a secret service man. I won't say anything. Because I s suspicious looking people over there. You did? Yeah, they were over there, right over there. I don't know. They were very, very uh, suspicious. Yeah. Is it hard to get to be in the secret service? Why? Well, I was just curious, because I think I'd be good at it. I noticed there's a little, little pin there. That's like a signal, isn't it? Signal 38s, 45s, 357 Magnum, nothing bigger, maybe. Your name and address. We'll send you all the information on how to apply. How's that? Sure. Okay. He's going for that, Why not? Crinkle, K R I N K. Be careful today. Right, we'll do. You have to be careful in around a place like this. Bye. Want to get a picture? Come in. Shit, heel. Stand here. You make the move. You make the move. Ah. I'm trying you. You talking to me? You talking? You talking to me? Well, I'm the only one here. Who you think you're talking to? Oh yeah? Huh? Yeah. Sit down. Listen, you fuckers, you screwheads, who would not take it anymore. A man who stood up against Mr. the scum, Zinger. the cunt is. Ah. Travis the Titere, Capasa. Come out and give me the cash out the door. Come on. Okay, man. Don't shoot. I'm getting it. 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 Don't shoot. I'm getting
Listen, I ain't got a permit for this thing. I don't know what I'm doing. Don't worry about it, man. I'll take care of it. No, man, just, just get out of here. No, but the motherfucker this year. Dear father and mother, send you my address like I promised to last year. Demands utmost secrecy. I know we're making lots of money. I have been going with a girl for several months, and I know that I can tell you no more than that. Yeah, but you can't park here. Come on, come on, let's go, let's go, move it. Well, as it does me, I hope no one has died. Because I couldn't stand to be a cause of a divorce. I do love him. Um, Please don't. The TV is going to pour. To me. I love him. He's going to see him. So I depressed him. Yeah. See that guy over there? Yeah. Right. You go talk to him. His name is Matt. We're in here for a friend. You gonna bust me for nothing, man? I'm not a cop. That ain't a 38 you've got in your son. 38? No. Huh? <laughs> I'm $15, 15 minutes, $25, half an hour. Well, take it or leave it. If you want to save yourself some money, don't fuck her. 12 and a half years old, you ain't never had no pussy like that. Uh -huh. Come on, I fuck her in the mouth, fuck her in the ass, come on her face, go. But no rough stuff. Yeah, it's All right, take out my money over here. You wanna fuck me? You ain't gonna fuck me. You're gonna fuck her. You give her the money. What'd you say? I'll see you later, cop. I'm no cop, man. Well, if you are, it's entrapment already. I'm hip. <laughs> funny, you don't look hip. <laughs> You're a funny guy. But looks are on everything. Go ahead, man. Have a good time. Hey. Roll cost you ten bucks. It's another scare. I'm telling you, too. <laughs> Come on. Are you really 12 and a half? Mister, it's your time. 15 minutes ain't long. What's your name? Easy. Well, that's not any kind of name. Oh, it's easy to remember. I like my real name. Well, what's your real name? Iris. Well, what's wrong with that? That's a nice name. <laughs> That's what you think. No, don't do that. Don't do that. When you remember me, I got into a taxi. It was a checkered taxi. You got in, and that, that guy Matthew came by, and he said, Well, that's all right. I'm going to get you out of here. So we better make it, or Sport will get mad. Oh, that's Matthew. I call him Sport. Want to make it like this? Listen, I... I, I Listen, can't you understand something? But you're the one that came into my cab. Oh, come off it, man. What are you doing? Investigate. Don't you want to make it? I make it. I want to help you. Well, I can help you. God damn, man. God damn it. What the hell's the matter with you? Listen, you don't have to make it, mister. God damn it. Don't you want to get out of here? I tried to get into your cab one night, and now you want to come and take me away. I can leave any time I want to. The one about that one night. Look, I was stoned. That's why they stopped me. Stoned, I had no place else to go. Protect me from myself. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I understand. And it means something, you know? See you again? <laughs> That's not hard to do. No, I don't mean like that. I don't. What about breakfast tomorrow? Tomorrow? What? I get up at about 1 o'clock. 1 o'clock? 1 o'clock. Uh, 1 or not? Yeah, I want. Uh, okay, all right. Okay, 1 o'clock. 1 o'clock. My name is Travis. Thanks a lot, Travis. Oh, sweet Iris. This is yours. Spend it right. Like any time, cowboy. I will. I need to go back to my parents. I mean, they hate me. There's nothing there. Yeah, but you can't live like this. It's a hell. Did you ever hear of women's lib? What do you mean, women's lib? You should be going out with boys. You should be going to school. You know, that kind of stuff. You're the one that's square. You're full of shit, man. Fucking creeps and lowlifes and degenerates out on the street and you sell your, sell your little pussy for nothing, man. You're the one that's square, man. I don't go school and fuck with a bunch of killers and junkies the way you do. Where are you from? Fort never killed him. He killed He's someone. a Libra. He's a what? I'm a Libra, too. That's why we get... That's what the accident. The cancers make the best lovers, but... 
God, my whole family are air signs. He's also a dope shooter. Did you ever try looking at your own eyeballs in the mirror? What are you gonna do about supporting that old bastard? When? When you leave. Well, yeah, they got plenty of other girls. Yeah, but you just can't do that. What are you gonna do? Well, the cops don't do nothing, you know that. that. I mean, he didn't beat me up or anything like that once. But you can't allow him to do the same to other girls. He's the lowest kind of person in the world. Somebody's got to do something to him. He's the scum of the earth. He's calling you names. He call you a little piece of chicken. She doesn't mean that. I'll move up to one of them communes in Vermont. The commune with me. Or come, come to the commune with you? No, no. I, I, don't, I don't go to places like that. What? That's it. You're a scorpion. I can tell every time. Something very important to do. Oh, so what's so important? Doing something for the government. Do I look like an art? Yeah. <laughs> I am an art. <laughs> Weird, are you or me? I'm gonna do. I'm gonna give you the money to go. I want you to take it. I don't want you to take anything from them. I might be going away for a while. Second call, he's two seven and a half. I don't want you to like what you're doing. If you ever liked what you were doing, you wouldn't be my woman. No time with me anymore. I got to attend to business, baby. Come to me, baby. You're close to me like this. I feel so good. Every man can know what it's like to be loved by you. And a man who loves her like I love you. God, it's good. So close. And you that keeps me together. <laughs> is pointed in one direction. I see that now. There has been any choice for me. Senator Charles Palantine. Today, at a crossroads, Columbus Circle. This is no ordinary place. For far too long, the wrong roads and inflation. Today, I say to you, we have reached the turning point. Well, no, the right road and the good. And it is time to let the people rule. Chicken to drink. everything in the pimp business. Boss, huh? Do I know you? Oh, I don't Iris. know nobody named Iris. Iris, come on, get out of here, man. Get back to your fucking tribe before you get hurt, huh, man? Do me a favor. I don't want no trouble, huh? Okay? Get out of here. Suck on this. Oh, 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 oh. Just that, that. It's going to go to the room. So it's dead too. You can't say how happy Mrs. Steensma and I were to hear that you are well and recuperating. 
We can repay you for returning our iris to us. And now it's our cool. lives are full again. The hero around this household, back in school and working hard. The transition has been very hard for her. Has never caused to run away again. I would like to again thank you from the bottom of our hearts. And to Pittsburgh, you would find yourself a most welcome guest in our home. Bert and Ivy Steensma. Charlie T. Hello, Travis. Hello. What this guy again? I hear Palantine got the nomination. Seventeen days. I hope he wins. I read about you in the papers. How are you? Oh, it's nothing really. I get over that. Papers always blow these things up. Just a little stiffness. That's all. Slowly, this is just one to do some good. What's a crazy story? That's what's up.